What's going on everybody? DJ Goham here. Hope you guys are having a great day. Welcome back to Mercury Farms. We got Mrs. Aussie's Christmas tree back. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. And we got a brand new truck. Let's jump in. Oh yeah. So today we are going to take a look at a couple different things. First up, we're going to take a look at the sell points, their locations, and what you can sell at each one because they are not all the same. There are a few that are completely different. So first things first, we are going to be heading all the way down. We're going to head to Windmill Hill first. Now, Windmill Hill is located over by the poultry farm. And what should we be able to do there? So we be able to do mostly the main crops. The really cool thing about Windmill Hill is it's a hill and there are windmills. And they sound really good. <laughs> Let's check. Oh, no, no, no. We're, we're spinning out of control. There you go. Windmills everywhere. They can be a little loud. So let's plop it up. Let's jump in here. Let's take a look at what we can sell at Windmill Hill. So again, Windmill Hill is a very standard place, but you can't sell everything. So you've got wheat, barley, sunflowers, corn, and that's it. So not every crop. Very interesting the way the way Alien Jim comes and does that kind of thing. I like it. I dig it because there's some things just like you, some things you just can't sell there. <laughs> that's okay. Next up, we're going to be heading to the Vehicle Grain Shop. Now, do keep in mind that you can sell things at the biogas plant. However, those are your standard biogas things. You can sell hay bales, straw bales, grass. Uh, that kind of thing, silage. I don't think you can sell TMR there. We'll, we'll talk about TMR shortly because it is an alien gym map. So you can guarantee there's a few tricks up his sleeve. However, biogas plant, pretty normal, straightforward. Oh, can we make it? Yes. Also, we are driving around in alien gym's brand new colors right here. Orange with black wheels. Couldn't get the green to look just right. Uh, I'm trying to work on something in my spare time that's going to bring that green back. Unfortunately, I have no idea what I'm doing. So that's a whole different story as far as modding goes. So here we are at Vehicle Shop Grains. Now this is going to be more of what you're used to. Your wheat, your barley, canola, sunflower, soybeans, corn, potatoes, sugar beets, sugar cane. Candies, candy corns. <laughs> I feel like an elf. I feel like elf whenever I'm saying all that. So those are your primary crops from FS17. Now, heading to here we go. Gotta start the thing up. Heading to animal stores, animal dealer. That is a little bit, a uh, little bit different. Well, I say, I say a little bit different pretty close if not exactly the same to where we just were at the vehicle shop grains now we're heading down livestock market animal dealer i believe is oh man animal livestock market yes uh, you've got your animal dealer down there located as well let's fly 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 I'll tell you what it is just a beautiful looking map jim has done a fantastic job getting everything working getting everything ready for us for fs19 i'm so excited i'm so pumped he's still working on a lot of things hang tight it's gonna take some time but he's got good things coming very good things so you can see off in the distance we've got our smokestacks we're gonna be hanging a right because if we didn't let's just see what happens if we go straight <laughs> yeah we hit a wall didn't we i'm not going to show you how to get past that but yeah, you, you can that's all i'm saying you can let's swing this around so livestock market you got your wheat barley canola sunflower soybeans corn potatoes sugar beets now you can also sell things pretend this is barn 
you can also sell barn stuff here, which is extremely cool. Got your animals there. Boom. Sell right here. Anything you could sell at barn in FS17 or FS19 for that matter, you could sell there. And right here is your primary sell point. Very, very, very cool. And so we want to be heading to, oh goodness, follow the signs here, Garden Center. That's exactly where we want to head. Excuse you. Excuse you. Who are you? Who are you? <laughs> heading over to Garden Center. Now the Garden Center is, it is the bee's knees of Mercury Farms. It is the thing. If you need it, if you want to sell it, that is the place to do it. There is no sell point anymore down at Spar, so anything you could have sold there before, you cannot sell there now. Keep that in mind. Here we are at the garden center. Might as well cut our blinkers on. Wait for the car to go by. Boom. So you could do pretty much anything that you can think of here. Now, a few things that I'm not going to talk about just because I want you to find out for yourself once the game comes around. But we're going to swing around first. Now, I believe this is a fuel point, even though carrying around fuel is pretty difficult right now, especially in larger chunks. We have what is your barn area here, as well as in here. This is where you can dump all your loose stuff. Loose hay, grass, straw. That's what you can dump in there. Here's your wool cell point. Wood chips. Right there. Slurry. Manure. And Jim has told me that he is working on this area right here. To come back and said things have changed for FS19. You can't just sell things the way you used to could in FS19, or FS17, sorry. And that's also the reason why there's not a lot going on up here yet. You may remember from FS17, all through here, all through here, we had greenhouses. You could sell water, and you could do manure. Well, you can't really do that now. So, yeah. So he's figuring out a way to make that happen. He is the man. I'm sure he'll figure out something. And if it's not the same, it's going to be something even cooler. But for now, he's working on this area right here to work. There's a special feature with this area. And if he doesn't change anything, refer to this video. Because there is something really cool about this area. I can't tell you what it is. Just make sure you turn on your help window. That's all I'm saying. All right. <laughs> enough being said enough being said here's where you sell all your wood this works just like normal for any fs19 wood sell point come right in here boop plop your wood come over here click in your left stick bam wood sells here's your unloading bay goods in so this is going to be where you sell your pallets seed fertilizer lime currently right now the only things not selling are these right here and these right here so the uh, saplings are not selling and nor is the herbicide nor the s liquid fertilizer but said solid fertilizer definitely not solid liquid fertilizer uh, but as you can see right here sugar cane good oh no no wait this sugar cane that was poplars no oh. Come back. <laughs> Boom. Sell. All good. And you've probably seen this once or twice, but give me that bag. Lime sells as well. Very cool. Let's drop that. Let it do its thing. Let it get it. Sell on. And of course, you have your primary sell point over here as well. A normal sell point. So let's take a look. Saving, of course. <laughs> Garden center. We've got... Wheat, barley, oats, canola, sunflower, soybeans, corn, potatoes, sugar beet, <gasps> cotton, sugar cane, potatoes, <laughs> wool, milk, wood chips, silage, grass, hay, straw, slurry, manure. You can also do chaff, 
You can do silage, TMR. That is said silage already. Let's see, let's go through here. Chaff, silage, TMR, pig food. Those are the things that you'll be able to sell over here. Pretty much anything you can make and anything you can put together or have in general, you can sell here. Now, as far as water goes, I don't think there is a water sell point here right now. There was in 17. However, I don't think there is one here in 19. If there is, he has not told me about it yet. So, Jim, if you're watching, is there, is there a water sell point? Maybe, 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 maybe. Oh, slam on the brakes. Vehicle shop, livestock market. Let's go right. So what do you guys think about this map so far? I think it's amazing. Uh, Jim has done an awesome, awesome, awesome job getting things together, having things that connect and, and different bits and pieces here or there. Jim done a really good job. Now there are a couple other things, a couple things around um, by the way, here's a field that I don't know if I ever saw anyone using. So this is field 23. Now, you do not start with get out of here, birds. <laughs> you do not start with field 23. However, uh, right now in the beta testing, we have access to this field. This is a massive, massive, huge field. It's one, well, yeah, it's one of the larger fields on the map. So, as you know, and as you've probably remembered, with grass fields the way those worked in FS 17 on this map is you would go to the store and you would buy them well obviously you know that is not the case anymore that is not the way it works so make sure you're not going to the store looking for stuff I was doing that too uh, I, I actually hit up Jim and said hey Jim um how do I buy the grass fields? He's like, really? I'm like, oh yeah, no, never mind. Never mind. I gotcha. That was a mistake. Big mistake. So we're here, we're here. You guys have seen the BGA. I think we showed this off yesterday. We'll come back, swing through here. Two huge BGA bunkers. I mean, massive. These things are, I don't know if they're the same size as we had in Lone Oak. But you're going to be able to hold millions and millions of liters of chaff in those. Swing through here. Also, you may notice in the map down at the bottom left-hand corner, around the outsides, you've got this dark green with, of course, the lighter green. Oh, I can't, I can't drive. <laughs> with the lighter green on the inside. Now, there is a way to get outside of that dark green. I'm not going to share that with you just yet. It is exactly the same as it was in FS17. So if you did have FS17 and you did play this map, you will already know how to get outside this map. It's really cool. It is really cool. Uh, also, I have talked with Jim. He's working on a few extra little bits and pieces here and there. Uh, some things, some lighting things, uh, maybe a couple surprises with the lighting. Um, I don't know exactly what his plans are with that. I just know what we had talked about. Some really cool stuff coming. Some different stuff. I know a couple of people have said, you know, oh, well, it's this, it's that, da 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 da, -da whatever. This is different. The gameplay is going to be different. The way you approach this map is going to be different from 17. I'm sure you're going to love it. Because I know I am just biting at the bullet right now to play. Uh, I am holding off right now until we get whatever the version is that is sent to Giants. Uh, whatever version that Jim decides to send off to Giants. Ooh, can we hit him? Can we hit him? T-Bone! Yes! Crap. <laughs> whatever version Jim decides to send off to Giants, uh, I will show you guys off as an official. Official. But until then, we have some really cool stuff going on over here some really great stuff Jim's been absolutely wonderful to work with I do appreciate you if you're watching this and if you guys have anything down below that you would like to see let us know in the comment section uh, of course positive negative it's all open 
it's all accepted. Uh, just what are your, uh, maybe not your thoughts and that kind of thing, uh, because keep in mind, we're not done yet. Uh, Jim is far from being finished with this map. Uh, we're not to 90% yet. So keep that in mind with whatever you said. But if you've got a really good cool ability, like, yo, this would be cool, or, or, you know, have you tried this, that, or da 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 da, drop that in the comments below. We want to hear from you. We want to hear what your ideas are, what you guys would like to see for Mercury Farms for FS19. But with that being said, that is going to be it for today. I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like. If you're not already, please subscribe. If you have any questions about this map, feel free to ask down below. I'll be happy to help you guys out. With that being said, I hope you have a great day. And we will see you later. Peace.